Hello everyone, this is a, a continuation of Spider-Man. Please enjoy. MJ's at Sable's Central Park compound. I need to check on her. Looks like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired, old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. He's not too excited. Where are you, MJ? Crap. Reach him. That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Whose bright idea was it to put a circuit board in a fence? Out of the way, fella. What was that? Gotta move. Now. Check on our house guest. Stay here. Copy. House guest. Must be Standish. 
He's here somewhere. What's that? This was nothing. Demons are killing anyone related to Devil's Breath. Standish is in real danger. I should get a photo of this. Got it. Time to move. Standish. I knew it. I've got to get to that tent. something about Dr. Michaels. Crap. Generator tripped. I won't distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five. As soon as boss gives the word, we'll get Michaels moved to the new safe house. They're moving him. Have to find out where before we lose our shot. That, huh? Who's there? Standing down, control. Pulse the move. Get that truck moving. Should have been uptown half an hour ago. Copy. We're rolling. Truck's about to move. Should use it as cover. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Understood, ma'am. Don't care how many men Sable has. She won't be able to stop Martin Lee. units. He carries the only sample of Devil's Breath. I will not be responsible for pandemic. Understood, ma'am. Don't care how many men Sable has. She won't be able to stop Martin Lee. Copy that, Control. We're five by five. Charlie are both on deck for Dr. Michael's relocation, ma'am. Add two more units. 
He carries the only sample. Looks important. I got nothing. Don't we Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. Perfect. Gotta move. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else to secure it. Hope his ego doesn't bite him in the ass. Again? What's up with these lights? Wait! There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust anyone else. To... Again? What's up with these lights? there. I see something. Checking it out. Something control. Stand by. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles. Where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Look. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. Watson. I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What the hell? He's not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. 
Sorry, Charlie. Get the back up over here. Okay, time Wait, to go. No, he knows something. <laughs> That was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you've got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I screwed up. It was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military. You know what? Can we not do this right now? Please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still mad. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol. Report of a bomb threat. Location is Cathedral. Spider-Man, thank God. Demons have rigged explosives all over the building, but we can't get close. Point me at him, officer. I'm here to help. We've located the primary device. If you can disable it, it'll cough up an army key. You can use that to locate and disable the secondary device. Got it. Keep your men back. I'll radio when it's clear. to get that arming key. Don't think about the block of C4 this is wired to.
disarmed. Got the key. Oh no. Fail safe tripped. Timer's just engaged for the other bombs. Gotta move quick. Snipers, they could go after the police. Just another day in the life. You and your men take care, officer. Peter, I'm about to begin another test. Oh, sorry. My bus broke down and there were no cabs. But I'll be there as soon as I can. Mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Drio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know. And I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us.
Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? It looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit.
finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... ...it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. 
I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Showed up with stains on my shirt, ten minutes late from stopping a mugging. Still can't believe Doc hired me. Hope he doesn't regret it now. Direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Hmm. Vulture might be the smartest guy up on this wall. Not smart enough to duck three consecutive life sentences, of course, but still pretty. Mob enforcer turned walking tank. Rhino's racked up enough property damage to destroy Manhattan three times over. Gonna miss that humorless grimace. Huh. <laughs> Electro was the first legit super-powered villain I fought. Till then, it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. If we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My... Aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! What are you doing here? Oh, we got a fight? 
fighter. You just made your last mistake, punk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> The other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay. Okay? I can <clears throat> Oh, sh... S sorry No, no. No. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you keep that up, and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh... Thanks. You know... Anytime. I just punch Spider-Man. Hey man, you got you got anything? Shelter should be just ahead. Um, so uh Yo Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would have bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Keep moving. Keep moving. Farmer's market. I can cut through there. I can't believe you're saying that. Nope. Right. 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 Well, when you say it like that, how would you say it? Red blood right here. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Kidding me? It's gonna take forever. If that drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. Do you know anyone by the name of Martin Lee? Have you seen him? The little hacker he could do the trick. He just needs to isolate the drone signal. Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecure. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren.
go under the gate on the left or over the scaffolding to the right. Sector clear. Continuing patrol. Okay, my faithful listeners. I've been getting a lot of calls about this Sable International outfit that's assisting police with the search for suspects in the city hall. Line. I've got Ken on line three with some thoughts. Ken, you're on with J. Jonah James. First of all, I just want to say it's an honor to be on your show. Thank you, Ken. You just earned yourself a copy of... Hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the thief shelter okay? Uh, yeah. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. And this is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee, all right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got the time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. <laughs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Hey. 
Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. Here. Hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's going to be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. See if Aunt May needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. Hope you all liked the video. Please like, share, and subscribe.